Good evening to all my Facebook, YouTube, family and friends, and fellow outdoor enthusiasts. Welcome to Cascade Ride Adventures. I'm Todd Schillam, and I am here for the first ever uh, to do a uh, route planning video with you. Uh, this this uh, upcoming weekend, I'm going to go out and jump on the Himalayan. And last weekend, I actually was out at Coplay Lake, and I'm going back again to capture some more video and do some more things. But I thought I'd just kind of go over some material with you real quick, kind of share with you what the route plan is, some highlighted uh, details about uh, just route planning in general. And, uh, yeah, get, uh, get you all amped up for uh, taking a look at some of the video that I'm going to do. So uh, the, I, I live in Spanaway, just south of Tacoma. And uh, let me zoom out here and kind of get you oriented. So here's uh, here's Tacoma, Seattle up there, and uh, Spanaway right here. Um, basically, I'm going to head out east to, and head over to a town called Ording. Most of this is urban area, so and, uh, and you don't get anything until more rural, rural like farmland and forest and stuff like that until you get out. So, But when you get down to Ording down here, yeah, it's a bunch of farmland. And you got these small, real small towns, and then you got you get into the forests. It's just a gorgeous ride from Carbonado all the way out to the Mount Rainier National Park at the northwest uh, boundary of the park, and then you get on a Forest Service road and take the rest of the way up to Copley Lake. But uh, just to kind of go over some things real quick, um, I'm going to probably start doing I. I'm going to get some action camera footage this time. Actually, on the bike for the first time ever. Uh, matter of fact, I still got you. I got the action camera helmet mount, and I'll actually be packing my action camera on the front so you actually see video of me riding this upcoming weekend. Um, I'm also bringing the I'm also bringing the drone. You'll have that as well. And so, well, what I'll have uh, I'll actually use the follow me feature of the drone and actually get aerial footage behind me or in front of me of riding the bike uh, out there on this particular route. Uh, most likely I'll be doing that between Carbonado and Copley Lake and I'll definitely get some of the video footage of me riding up through the off-road on the Himalayan and uh, of course the lake itself it's always it's always very pretty up there and so it'll be a lot of fun. Um, one of the things I like to do when I do route planning, just to kind of share with you in general, if you if you watch videos again with me and doing route planning, is I do like the uh, terrain layer of Google Maps. It's really really nice. Um, so that helps me get a sense of you know where things are at, where you know ridges, uh, valleys, those kinds of things. You can see uh, you know Ording obviously in a valley, and you're kind of going through that all the way to South Prairie, Wilkinson, Carbonado. Um, you get up here on a ridge a little bit and then you drop back down across the Carbon River and then you start to climb there in the last part of that forest road uh, up to Copley Lake, which uh, is a lot of fun. Um, a couple of interesting highlights. Uh, one, Carbonado uh, right here at the bridge crossing. There's a lot of dis free dispersed camping down there for people that enjoy uh you know, free camping. There's lots of free camping right down here in this particular area. It's kind of nice because I see uh, people ride motorcycles down there and other ATVs, UTVs, that kind of stuff. Um, and so a lot of fun down there for folks that enjoy that, that kind of stuff, car camping and stuff. Uh, really cool. And they also feature a great pizza place over in Wilkeson. Uh, there's a restaurant out there and a couple of small taverns. Really fun places to visit out there. Uh, definitely encourage people to go down and, and see the sights to see down there. And it's just a uh, nice day. You can also take a road that you see split here right at uh, just before Fairfax. And this takes uh, uh, 165. Um, that heads up to Evans Creek ORV Park, and it continues along until you get to uh, Mowich Lake Campground, which you can see right over here. Mowich Lake's great. You do have to pay the park entrance fee to get in there, but it's fabulous, and it's a stop on the Wonderland Trail, so it's cool. If you go up to Mowich Lake uh, and, and visit Mount Rainier National Park up there, lots of trails that you can go ex explore up there. Uh, just, just a lot of fun at Mowich Lake. I would encourage anyone to go out there at least once and, and go take a look at that and, and just be a part of all that it's a lot of fun um but yeah that's it for the route you know i'm gonna head down here and i'll get video footage and uh you know this upcoming weekend but i hope to see you all in uh this week weekend and uh have fun and enjoy the rest of your evening and we'll talk to you all later bye